Hey guys, today we're back with another video. It's Memorial Day weekend, so a friend and I are heading out of town on a camping and boating trip. It should be a lot of fun. We have a long three-day weekend until we gotta get back to work here. So it's 8 a.m. I told my friend I'll be at his house at like 8.30, so we gotta get everything loaded up pretty quickly. Today, guys, I'm going to be driving the 2019 Ram 3500 Limited, fully loaded, the perfect truck for a road trip, and we're going to be towing our tri-axle toy hauler here. We have two three beds, but uh, the best thing about this, we could use it for sleeping at night, but hauling all the toys over there as well, which is pretty sweet. You guys might be asking, where's the toys? Well, guys, our garage is full here, so we're going to be bringing an extra dirt bike for our friend to use. We're going to have two dirt bikes, we're going to have a player's two-seater, and the friend is going to bring his lake boats since there's a lake right next to the campgrounds here so it's gonna be a lot of fun and like always guys there is a full mods list listed down below here but let's get everything loaded up we don't want to be late and we want to get the weekend start early Oh man, guys, this triaxle toy hauler is pretty heavy here. I just attached it, and you can already starting to see that the uh, ram is sitting a bit low here in the back. But we have the tow mirrors folded on out. I will say, guys, this is pretty patriotic. We got a red truck and a blue and white camper. That is pretty sweet, but let's get turned on around. it. Let's get the uh, ramp drop back here. But uh, back here in the toy hauler, we actually have a few beds that kind of fold up to the ceiling that allows us to uh, fit a few toys inside here. And these these are actually pretty popular around us as well and we're actually heading to Richport campgrounds as well which should be pretty sweet here but I think we should probably put the dirt bikes in first. Now I hope everyone has a great Memorial Day weekend, spend time with friends and family and let me know how it was as well. But I thought what if we go camping, we'll beat the rush, uh, there's going to be a lot of traffic heading out of town as well. So that's a good thing, leaving uh, uh, on an early Friday and we get uh, probably about a half day extra as well, which is going to be pretty sweet here. But I think we're going to be coming back Sunday night, maybe Monday morning and if needed I could always take off an extra day of work here. But both dirt bikes are ready to go, I did make sure the fluids and everything is good and we are going to be bringing with us like a hundred gallons of fuel so we have a lot of fuel to burn that means we're going to have lots of fun all right, we're going to be putting the player's two-seater in. Now, this is going to be the perfect two-seater here for us. A friend can hop in, and this is going to be a lot of fun here. So, let's get it loaded on up here. Now, I do have a tune on and a chip, uh, so it does go a bit faster here. But I'm going to get the house locked up, get everything strapped down, and we'll catch you guys on the road. I just set the GPS, guys. Looks to be a four-hour drive here for us. No problem. And I just sent my friend a text that we're on the way. Now, he didn't respond. Hopefully, he's up. Hopefully, he didn't sleep in. In, but he, he is on the way out of town here he's like uh, only about a half mile from us so we'll stop by there uh, hopefully he's ready to go and then uh, we could both do a mini convoy over to campgrounds Oh, look at that, guys. We have arrived here at our friends. Now, you guys can see here there is quite a few uh, things outside in the driveway. Are you ready to go on this camping and boating trip? Yeah, I'm excited, but I'm a little delayed. Sorry about that. Yeah, I can help you on out. I got up bright and early. I got everything packed. I got two dirt bikes. I got that two-seater player so we could be ripping around in that. But I also brought a few fishing rods. I don't know if you had any, so I just brought mine. Oh, that sounds fun. Yeah, but look at that in your driveway. That's a pretty sweet camper you have. Oh, yeah, I rented this camper right here. You can see the wonderful paint job on it. It's got the patriotic colors, the red, white, and blue, and I love it. Yeah, that must have been a bit pricey for the week. Yeah, I actually got it for a decent price, I'd say. Yeah, that's awesome. Oh, guess what? I have one more thing to tell you. I'm bringing an Xbox with Farming Simulator. No way, that's awesome. We're going to be able to uh, play farm some while we're camping then. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. Yeah, it looks like you also have a Toyota Tacoma. Oh yeah, this is my red Toyota Tacoma right here. Yeah, it looks very similar to last time I see it. Oh, look at that. You got new wheels on it. Yeah, I just put these on. Yeah, that's awesome. So uh, why don't I help you out so we could uh, hit out on the road quick? Sounds good. Yeah, so what are you going to be taking? Just the lake boat? Yep. Awesome. So if you want to hop in, I'll help you out because that, uh, to get backed in, is going to be a bit tricky. All right, keep it coming. Keep it coming. Another two feet here. Just a little more. Perfect. Let me help you out with the jack here. Put the cables on. I think you're ready to go. Thank you. Yeah, so let me hop in my truck and uh, follow me. I already got the GPS set up. Alright, I'll be right behind you. 
Yeah, so since it's Memorial Day, we might get into some traffic, but the GPS shows it's only four hours right now. Oh, okay. All right, uh, I, we'll stop at a rest stop as well to get fuel here in a bit. Yeah, we'll probably need some fuel. We'll be burning a lot. Yep, all right, well, uh, see you here in a bit. All right, guys, we're all ready to go. It's just past nine, so we're right on track here. Now, we do have to get checked in at the campgrounds. You guys can see our friends behind us. And I will say, guys, that is a pretty neat setup there. I really do wish I could rent one of those one day. I mean, that is like a full-fledged house on wheels. That is pretty sweet here. But let me know down below in the comments, guys, how you are liking these role-play, these multiplayer videos. I do want to do a lot more of them here on the channel. And I think it's going to be a lot of fun here. But I will say, guys, I could definitely feel the way here it's a pretty heavy load for us but i don't think the uh, cummins is gonna have any problems but i will say guys having a limited and taking it on a road trip's the way to go oh look at that guys we're passing by john deere if we did have a little bit of extra time if we were a little bit earlier i would say let's stop and just take a look at the equipment here but we are just cruising down here we're getting pretty close only about a half hour left here we are guys, we have arrived at the campgrounds, look at that huge lake there to the right hand side and look at this area, complete woods, there is acres and acres of woods here for us, so I'm excited for that, it's going to be a pretty fun week here, we could definitely do maybe a little bit of hiking, I do want to get some fishing in, but we actually have to check in really quickly at the small booth here, uh, I believe we just have to kind of sign in here, now we got it for three days and they did say we could uh, get any extra space if we need it, hey I'm going to sign in quickly. Do you mind checking me in as well? Yeah, I could do it really quickly. All right, we're all checked in for the weekend. Uh, I think you should probably just follow me on over to the uh, campsite. All right, sounds good. Yeah, we got to be careful. We don't want to get this huge RV stuck. Yeah. All right, well, uh, just follow me. Just keep your walkie-talkie on if I need to uh, call to you. All right. All right, let's put the dually here in four high. We don't want to get stuck. We have a pretty heavy toy hauler, and uh, we do not want to have any uh, problems here. We want to start off the weekend strong, but let's see. They said the entire campgrounds is open. Looks like there's not too many people here, which is exciting. That means more fun up for us, and uh, we get first choice at the uh, campgrounds. But hey, we're going to be taking a right here. For our camping area, guys, I do want a nice big area here. We do want to kind of be back in the woods with lots of trees, but a little open area so we can fit everything. And I will say, guys, I think we're going to be getting pretty close here. Looks like it is opening up just a little bit longer here for us. But wow, I will say, guys, it was a pretty fun day here so far. But let me know, guys, what are you doing for Memorial Day? Are you doing a barbecue? Something fun like that. But I, I do see a nice big opening uh, back here. Yeah, this is actually going to be the area. Let's take a pretty sharp turn. Oh, yeah, this little open area will do for us here. Hey, I think this is going to be the spot. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, there looks to be a lot of open area here for our uh, rigs. So I think, uh, what if we get everything set up, get everything unloaded? But I'm thinking, now that I was looking at that lake with a boat ramp, it might be easier if I end up uh, towing the uh, boat to the ramp for you. Sure, we can do that. Yeah, so uh, let's get everything unloaded and then it, we'll work on that boat. But uh, I believe there is also a pond nearby, so we'll do some exploring, bring some fishing rods with us. I think that should be fun as well. Yep, I would love to catch some fish. Awesome, well, uh, let's get everything set up. You probably have stabilizers and different things slide out, so uh, that's you're going to have your hands full here getting it ready. Yep, let me go do that. Oh man, that was like an hour's worth of setup we just did. I know, it was a lot of work. Yeah, but I think this is the perfect fit here. We have uh, mine and then yours facing this way. And then look at that. Uh, looks like you bought, uh, brought one of these and I got the same one as well. Uh, so this will be perfect for making some food tonight. Yeah, I'm getting hungry. Yeah, so I'm thinking, why don't we go, uh, let's go exploring on the dirt bikes. And we'll bring a few fishing rods with us if we find that pond that I was reading about. All right, that sounds good. All right, let's get these things fired on up here. You could definitely see I've been ripping them a bit hard. And they definitely do need a, a wash here after this trip. Yeah, definitely a little pressure washing would be great. Yeah, so if you just want to follow me and let's just go ripping here. Oh man, these dirt bikes are a ton of fun so far. Yeah, they're actually fast too. Yeah, I'm going to be uh, covered in dirt here with all the gravel and dust flying up. Yeah. Yeah, so I think at the end of this gravel trail here, I think we'll be taking a right. Uh, uh, looking at my map here, uh, I think that's the way we're going to have to go. Oh man, look at this area we just found. Whoa, this is so cool. Yeah, I'm actually a bit surprised. I thought we were a little bit further away from the pond. Hey, now we can start fishing. 
Yeah, look at that up there. It looks like a waterfall coming off that tall mountain as well. Wow, that's a nice view. Yeah, so we do have uh, just uh, the regular bait here. So if you want to throw a line in, uh, let's see if we can catch some fish. I'm not really getting any bites. Yeah, me neither. Yeah, maybe uh, they already caught a lot of fish, or maybe it's just not the time. So why don't we hop back on the dirt bikes? I really want to go have some fun out on the lake. Maybe we could even put a few rods in there. Oh man, these are a ton of fun to rip around. Yeah, it was so fun. Yeah, but I'm a bit covered in dust, so why don't we uh, uh, bring the lake boat and put it in the water? All right. Yeah, so uh, why don't you just hop on in the uh, boat there? You definitely want to sit down, though. It's going to be a little bit of a rough ride, and I will drive you on over. How's the ride back there? Oh, it's nice. The breeze feels great. Yeah, it's a bit windy here, but it, it is a little bouncy from the rearview mirror, it seems. Yeah. Did you put the drain plug in? Yep. All right, let me uh, just take the strap off that way. Uh, we don't end up having any problems before it goes in. But if you want to get the engine fired on up, uh, you're almost ready to go. All right, tell me when to uh, stop. Uh, it should be good right there. All right, awesome. That was uh, pretty quick and easy. Yeah, great work. Do you think I can make this jump here? Yeah, I think you could do it. Yeah, the rocks are a little slippery here, so I definitely don't want to fall in. But let me give it a try. Oh, yeah. Nice. All right, so uh, let me just sit down here if you want to go for a rip. I think this seems like a good spot to try fishing. Yeah, this uh, seems to be a good place here. Little lily pads. It is a bit shallow here as well. Yeah, let me drop the anchor and we can try it out. Yeah, but I think I'm going to put the camera down here. That way we can just relax and have a great time uh, this weekend. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one. And subscribe for more.